Karen Donovan with another segment of You've Got Questions, We've Got Answers. Today's question is, how do I make a competitive offer when I'm buying a property? I wrote down four points that will help you to make a competitive offer when you're buying a property. And sellers, keep this in mind when you're negotiating with the buyer so that you can determine the best strategy for you. Okay, number one, I wrote down, determine the best price and terms. To do this, you need to run a comparative market analysis on the property and you need to find out from the sellers what terms will be exciting to them. And number two, submit your offer. And when you do this, make sure that you present your offer in its best light. If the seller is in a rush, make sure you have a quick closing date. If the seller needs more time, make sure that you give them the time. Also, make sure that you have your pre-approval letter and submit that when you do submit your offer. Step number three, negotiate your offer. And by this, I mean your offer can be accepted, rejected, or countered. You can continue to counter until your offer is fully accepted or rejected if that's the case. But make sure that you both, both parties, the seller and the buyer, sign the contracts so that you will have a fully executed contract once you have agreed on the price and terms. And last but not least, if you find a house that you really like, make sure that you act quickly. In this market, there is still a low inventory, and if there are other buyers competing, you want to be right there on the spot, ready to make your offer, get it negotiated and accepted before anybody else. If you have any questions about buying or selling, please don't hesitate to give us a call. You've got the questions, we've got the answers. Until next time, remember, make it a great day.